You see, if you have a shop vac, you can now vacuum it all up. Hey, you don't have to buy a shop vac. You don't need to have it that clean. You can take a broom, uh, a little crummy paintbrush, like I said, something like that. This is how your opening is gonna look, okay? Now, you can measure that and cut a piece of plywood and screw that in, being ready for the glass company. Well, that's about it, but there's one more important thing I wanna show you. This is the most important part of your project. You thought it was, you thought it was all about taking the window out and you thought everything was done. Well, the most important part of the project is when you take your trim off, and here's the old trim by the way, you gotta try to be careful when you're taking this stuff off. And you see all these bad boy nails. We gotta do something about that. I never leave something like this and think, oh, okay, I'm just gonna stack it up like that, I'll be careful. Uh, so um, when I throw it away, I know that the nails are there. I'll stack it up here like this, but inevitably, guess what happens? Kaboom, one comes down here like this, you know, you think, okay, I'll be careful. I'll step on it carefully. I've got, I've got boots on, whatever, which I don't today. But if you do and you think, oh, if I step on that, it'll be fine. Well, guess what? These nails go right through boots. I know. Why do I know? Because I've done it. That's why. So I never take a chance. When I see a piece of trim like this, and I know I'm not going to use it. I'll put my foot on it. I'm just gonna use my hammer, and you don't have to go in sideways like that. You can if it works, but ev ev evidently and inevitab inevitably, <laughs> say that five times fast, you're gonna, it's gonna slip off. So I just run it sideways, like that. And I wanna take all those down. Be careful, because you might think they're all down and you step right on a nail or something, okay? This is a, an important part of the project. Every boss would agree with me because you get an employee stepping on that or an owner, whatever. Now, you know what they tell you? They tell you you get lockjaw. Well, I've stepped on a nail. I've never gotten lockjaw before. Uh, and I don't know if that's, you know, it could be true in some places, but I've never had it. I've only stepped on here on a nail maybe uh, two times in my life. And boy, let me tell you, it is sore. Especially depending on how far you, you, you put it down into your foot, okay? So I just spend a few minutes, hey, it doesn't take that long to bend these nails down. Don't take it for granted. If you have one of your employees, one of your, your, uh, your apprentices, and ooh, look at that. See there, were you watching that? I didn't get all the nails down. You get an apprentice doing this, you flat out ask him, hey, did you get all the nails? You know, if he says yes, you know, go back and check his work. Now see something like that? If this nail is tight and if it's sticking out of the side, guess what? If this fold flops down like that to another piece of wood, you've got the nail sticking straight up. But see, this nail is loose. And so it's kind of a crappy nail. I guess what I could do is pop it out of there, okay? But most of them, you don't have to back out all the way, okay? It just depends how loose the nails are and stuff. Take another look. See how this one is, is pushed up? So you're just gonna have to decide. See, even a small trim like this. And just be careful when you put your foot on there because you could, you could grab one, the one that you thought you didn't see, your foot's gonna find. So you can keep your feet off it if you want. And I just go one by one. I'm telling you, that's the most important part of the project right there. Okay, well, that's all I got for this time. And I'll be back with more videos. What, to, what am I going to show you next time? I'm hoping that the glass company actually does come here towards the end of this coming week. And I'm probably not going to catch them installing them, but I want to show you the end product, see how well they do, uh, and, and show you a little bit more so that you can feel comfortable knowing that, hey, if you take your window out, what happens from here, okay? Don't forget, you can do it.